I'm Emma, and welcome to What's in My Bag. Okay. Um, I'm just going to tip it. Elegantly, of course. That's... Okay. So, book, Sapiens, really good. It's basically about the history of humankind. The most interesting thing I've learned is probably that like our language started out through gossiping. So you would tell, oh, so-and-so has been crossing the river at this time of night and blah, blah, blah. And so it, we, our language started by gossiping and, and finding signals and, and I think that's really, really cool. So we're all gossipers by nature. The one thing that I couldn't travel without uh, are probably my headphones. Yeah. I listen to um, a lot of Scissor. Control is one of my favourite albums. And I listen to a lot of Nat King Cole, Ella Fitzgerald, all of that kind of group as well. Trusty diary with my entire life in it. As in, you know, Vogue today. How exciting. Um, this is my necklace that I put in my bag earlier to keep it safe. My friend gave me this, got my initial on it, and I've got a guardian angel on there from a family friend. So yeah, it's very special to me, and I wear it every day. Th three different lip balms, for some reason. One, two, this is more of a lip pencil actually, but yeah, it's really nice. Two perfumes, because, you know, because I like to smell nice. I love like woody, um, peach and coconut are like my two favorite things in the world, and there are like undertones of peach and coconut in this, and it's just like wood and cedar and sandalwood. And it's um, what film character would my bag be? A modern day Celine in Before Sunrise, played by Julie Delpy, just because it's my favourite, it's one of my favourite films of all time. When is my bag heaviest and why? Uh, probably when I'm travelling or going somewhere, travelling. <laughs> no, I don't, I mean, when I'm going somewhere, so if I'm on a train or on a plane, I just try and cram as much as possible into one bag, because I don't like to travel with too many things, so I just cram. If I could trade bags with anyone, it would be Greta Gerwig. I'd like to see what is in Greta Gerwig's bag, because I love her. I'm, I see her as being quite poetic, and, but also really focused and, and ambitious, so I feel like she'd be quite organised, but have like, I can't imagine having poems in her bag just lying around from admirers. Je pense que mon sac montre que je suis très organisée et que j'aime bien le parfum et sentir bon et que j'aime bien écrire avec mon stylo plume, à l'ancienne, voilà. You have to put the flat things at the back of the bag for support. And then you put the little things to keep them safe. And then the things I'll need to just grab and go, i.e. charger and headphones. Voilà, see you later.